Hello everybody, in this particular video, I am going to discuss is NIPER exam is difficult compared to GPAT, yes or not? So the answer is no, NIPER exam is very very easy compared to GPAT exam, but why lot of people feel NIPER exam is difficult compared to GPAT exam? The reasons are here, NIPER exam was not a difficult even compared to GPAT exam, but in case of GPAT exam, they will ask the questions very very in depth and also they will ask some difficult questions, but in case of NIPER exam, they never ask difficult questions and they never ask in depth questions, they will ask only basic questions, that means you can easily answer, for example, who is the father of pharmacology or who is the father of pharmacology, these are direct questions, there is no nothing to think. If you know the answer, you can easily put so. That means sniper exam is very, diff very, very easy even compared to GPAT exam. But what is the major problem with the NIPER exam means it was written in a less time compared to GPAT exam. So you can see actually in case of GPAT exam they will give you 3 hours of time so that student get lot of time to think what is right and what is wrong answer. But in case of G but in case of your NIPER exam you have only 2 hours time to attempt the 200 questions but in case of GPAT exam we enough to attend the 125 questions they will give you time of more than 3 hours but in case of NIPER exam in order to attempt the 200 questions they will give only 2 hours time so that is a major difficult task here and at the same time in case of GPAT exam you get the time to review the answer what you put it is right or wrong but in case of NIPER exam you don't get the time because if you just read the question you have only time to read and answer after attempting the question you don't have even time to see that answer is right or wrong in case of NIPER exam but in case of GPAT exam you have the time that is the only major difference and at the same time another important difference is between the GPAT and NIPER exam is that the way of asking question is different in the NIPER exam see lot of people up to now they prepare for GPAT orientation and GPAT in case of GPAT exam yes they will ask the question in something different way and also in difficult way in GPAD but in NIPER that is not thing but in case of NIPER they will give the questions in a simplest way and at the same time why the people feel NIPER as something different the reason is that in case of GPAD exam we have the syllabus but in case of NIPER exam we don't have the syllabus but the same syllabus of GPAD will be replicated in NIPER exam also and after GPAD exam lot of students take their rest because if you see lot of people feel that we cracked GPAD we achieved something so that is the reason lot of students feel that and they feel proud and they stop reading I see this is the habit of lot of students after cracking GPAD they take the rest so if, because of that rest some students feel GPAD NIPER is difficult exam but if you see NIPER is very easy if you work hard lot of people work up hard up to GPAD but NIPER they take the rest if you are the student like that you are doing blunder mistake but 90% of students do this blunder mistake after cracking GPAD they take the rest and they enjoy but the students who not take the rest and who not enjoy after your GPAT exam, they get the good success because of NIPER exam is the major one, not the GPAT. GPAT is the one step, but the NIPER exam is the final destination for your career. So that is the reason don't take rest and prepare. So if you take if you take the rest, so no one will help you to do that something. And what we need to get the success in NIPER. So if you want to get the success in NIPER exam. <coughs> Read always in a comprehensive manner. That means you already prepared very well for GPAT exam. If you, you see here, in case of NIPER exam, uh, the you all you already cracked NIPER exam means you already prepared very well for GPAT exam. So what you need to do? Say take the same syllabus sheet and take the same book what you prepared or say take the same coaching material what you prepared. So read all the things in a comprehensive way. So if you started reading all the syllabus in a comprehensive way automatically you get a very good success after reading the other syllabus in a comprehensive way after reading you can attempt the online test so and try to tune your mind to attempt the 200 questions in a just two hours time so if you do this thing automatically NIPER exam is not difficult and it became very very easy definitely you will get a very good rank not only you get a very good rank you definitely go to the NIPER Mohali and in good core branches so if you want to do that so do this thing and follow these strategies it will help you